Yo, what's going on, y'all? I wanted to make a little updated video talking about how to fix lethal company and error occurred. I will go a little more in depth this time. So basically, one more thing that you can try that I didn't mention in the previous video is when you go to lethal company, you can go to properties, installed files, and run verify the integrity of the game files. I'm gonna do it as well right now. This is one way to fix an error has occurred. So for me, all my files were validated. I didn't have any issues with that. Another thing that you can do is occasionally it's going to say XYZ mod is targeting this version of Beppin X. Most of the time you can just go to Beppin X new version. I've searched this up before because I've done this. And then 5.4.22 is the newest version and the newest version on Thunderstore is 5.4.21 if I remember correctly. Quick little editor's note uh, that I forgot to put into this video but I'm going to put a link down below. It's going to be not only a link to more articles that show you what you can do to fix this issue that I don't list in this video but it's also going to be a link to a video where I explain how to manually install the new version of BevanX because I completely forgot about it when I was recording this one so I apologize in advance but there's a few more steps after this and then if you want you can go to the description down below click the link for the new video and i'll show you how to install it over there thank you sorry again for the uh interruption all right good luck another thing that you can try doing is going to thunderstore itself this is one issue that i have had in the past and that is my own stupidity when i go to thunderstore sometimes i try to join the session and i don't even look at this sometimes mods get updated and they're out of date people in your group or people in the server that you might be trying to join may have those updates and you don't have them so you can try hitting update all i know that i've had some issues with that sometimes i've downloaded mods thinking that they are client side even though they weren't so whenever you're downloading mods make sure say let's go for the new backrooms mod this mod categories it only falls under miscellaneous but say that you want to get a mod that only affects you so let's go freddy bracken client side mod if it shows that it's client side that means it's only going to affect your game it will not affect anybody else's game only yours and then you just download that whatever but if you do have a mod that isn't client-sided make sure that everybody in your session has that mod and has the correct version of that mod Sometimes it really is just as simple as the mods that you were using are either one out of date or they're not going to work with another mod that you're trying to run. But that's just the case when it comes to modding. So I hope this updated video helps you guys out and I hope you have a good day. Thank you guys again for all the support.